Hello friends, today in this video I am going to cover how to multiply 3 digit numbers by 1 digit number. So let's get into our first example here and find the product. Three hundred fifteen times eight. So for the first example, we have three hundred fifteen times eight. When you are given a problem like this, where the numbers are written side by side, then you need to rewrite in stacked form. The order of problem doesn't matter. Means three hundred fifteen times eight or eight times three hundred fifteen is equal. But while when you line the problem up, it is the best way to write the number which has most digits on the top and the lowest digits on the bottom. So line this problem up. So 315 times 8. Make sure you line up all your places. So 5 and 8 are lined up because they are in one's place. Now we are ready to multiply. So, so 8 times 5 is 40. So I write 0 here and I carry this 4 here in tens place. Now 8 times 1 is 8. But we can't write 8 down here because we have to add this 4 in 8. So, 8 plus this 4 equals 12. So, I write 2 down here and I carry this 1 here. Now, 8 times 3 is 24. But, we, we have to add this 1 in 24. So, 20, 24 plus 1 equals 25. So, I write 5 here and as you see here, we don't have any more digits to carry over to. So, we drop our 2 here and we get 2520 as answer when we multiply 315 by 8. Let's take another example 865 times 7 first thing we need to do is line this problem up. So, we have 865 times 7. Make sure that 5 and 7 are lined up because they are in one's place. Now, we are ready to multiply. 7 times 5 is 35. So, I write 5 here and I carry this 3 in tens place. Now, 7 times 6 equals 42, but we have to add this 3 in 42. So, 42 plus 3 equals 45. So, I put this 5 down here and carry this 4 in hundreds place. Now, 7 times 8 is 56 and we have to add this 4 in 56. So, 56 plus 4 equals 60. So, I write 0 here but you see here but we, we do not have any more digits to carry over to. So, I drop 6 here and we get 6055 as answer. Now we can go through one more but before that like my this video because you are one like boost my confidence and also subscribe to my channel because I bring such type of informative math videos which will guide you definitely. So next example 480 times 9. So the given example is 480 times 9. And the numbers are written side by side. So we need to do is line this problem up. So, 480 times 
9. Make sure that 0 and 9 are lined up because they are in 1's place. Now we are ready to multiply. So 9 times 0 is 0, 9 times 8 is 72, but I can't put 72 down here. So I will just write here 2 and I will carry this 7 in 100's place. Now 9 times 4 equals 36, but we have to add this 7 in 36, so 36 plus 7 equals 43. So I write here 3, as you see we do not have any more digits to carry over to, so I drop this 4 here and we get 4320. Let us have a look one more example. 500 4 times 4. In given example, the numbers are written side by side. So, line this problem up 500 4 times 4. Make sure that these two 4s are lined up because they are in 1's place. So, 4 times 4 equals 16 and I write 6 here and carry this one in 10's place. Now 4 times 0 is 0 and 0 plus 1 is 1 and 4 times 5 is 20. So I write here 0 but there is no more digits to carry over 2 so I drop 2 here and we get 2016 when we multiply 504 by 4. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching and please like to my video and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.